paramedics with Ulaga Talala EMS pride themselves on responding to any emergency within 10 minutes. Far cry from what they had to deal with before the service was created in 2001. Well, originally they created the service because people in the community were waiting over 45 minutes for ambulance because of the rule setting, the geographic area that they had. But now, due to higher fuel and maintenance and lower reimbursements through Medicare and Medicaid, the ambulance service finds itself in danger. Worst case scenario is we would look at closing our doors probably in the middle of the year, say July, August. But there may be a way to save the struggling ambulance service through a program known as Seven Ready. It would charge a $7 monthly fee to residents who live within the district. The fee would be tacked on to either residents' electric or water bill depending on where they live. So right now we have part of our district covered with Verdigris Valley. We're trying to get the rest of the district covered through the Rural Water District 4, which would cover the towns of Ulaga and Talala. People basically, they're automatically enrolled, but they have to opt out if they don't want to participate. IV supplies. Uh... But in order for the program to succeed, officials need 70% to participate. Some residents we spoke to seem supportive. Would you be willing to pay a $7 monthly fee to keep the ambulance service around here. Yeah, I would. I think it's a good thing. I got a letter in the mail about it and uh, yeah, I'm going to pay for it. But others aren't so sure. Well, I don't mind paying a $7 fee if, you know, if I don't have to make a co-payment on my Medicare. But I'd kind of like to know more about it first. All residents can learn more about the program at a town hall meeting tomorrow night at the community center in Ulaga. Brandon Richard, 2 News, works for you.